Extended Access List. Ang Extended ACL gives you much power. Hindi ito katulad ng standard ACL. Limited lang ang magagawa mo. Ano nga ba ang pwede mong magawa dito sa ating extended uh, access list? Or ano ang pwede mong i-filter na traffic? So, tingnan natin doon sa susunod na slide. You can filter traffic based on source address from source address to destination address and also a protocol you can do that to filter the traffic using a TCP UDP all right ICMP ano bang ibig sabihin ng ICMP internet control messaging protocol etc all right source port if you are using a TCP or UDP, destination port. Also, if the protocol is TCP or UDP. And ICMP message if you are using the ICMP. About naman sa syntax, ne next page tayo. Okay, syntax, access list, uh, access list number. So, Alam natin ang access list number, ang pinag-usapan natin dito parekoy ay extended access list. So, it will start 100 up to 199 sa, no, sa normal range niya. Okay? Sa so expanded range naman ay 1,000, ay sorry, ay 2,000 to 2,699. And you can also deny the traffic and permit the traffic. The IP and of course, it's source wildcard. And the destination host with its des destination wildcard. Okay, this is the example of global configuration inside of this particular router. The access list, uh, you can configure the access list 100 deny IP, the IP address that you want to be denied to access this particular server 0.0.0.0. .0 .0 .0 to a destination host so this is our source ip to destination host of 192.168.2.2 our web server with an inverse mass of 0.0.0.255 you can also abbreviate the command line using host instead of typing the wildcard mass and this is our first line of configuration and the second line of configuration from top to bottom access list 100 we should film it the extended access list ip source 192.168.1.0 network will be permitted to access this our, to access this particular host our web server the destination ip address is 192.168.2.2 with wildcard mass of 0 0.0.0.255255 or you can simply use this type of command instead of typing this long command you can use the access list 100 permit IP any source any destination and to configure this uh, IP ACL in a particular interface sabi nga natin parekoy this is inbound okay and this is outbound. Tapos na tayo sa pag-configure ng outbound, kanina, that is the standard access list. It, it should be closest to the destination, but we are now configuring the extended access list. It must be here in this particular interface, FA0, 0. zero. So dito natin i-apply, it must be applied here, in, inside of this FA00, itong command na ito, parikoy. IP Access Group 100 Inbound. So, ito yung syntax niya, IP Access Group. The IP Access Group will be applied here, inbound, to this particular interface, FA00, in ulit ko. Pwede siyang number or name. Ganyan lang kasimple yan, parikoy, ang pag-configure ng IP Extended Access List. Last video na tayo, named ACL or named access list. Kasunod na yan.